This week, the Masters happening once again in Augusta with round one of tea, uh, with round one teeing off on Thursday. But today, members of the 9-11 Families United organization held a news conference in Atlanta denouncing the decision to allow Saudi Arabia backed live tour golfers to play in the Masters. The group claims the Saudi Arabian regime directly supported the terrorist involved in the 9-11 attacks that led to the deaths of thousands of Americans and that it is now trying to sports wash its image by pouring vast amounts of money into the live tour and its new play. Players. These same players who collected a gargantuan sum of money have a chance to compete with the morally sound PGA players and have an opportunity to put on the green jacket. They don't seem to care at all um, what it does to the 9-11 community or how they're promoting a country that doesn't deserve the respect that they crave and they're willing to pay billions of dollars for. Organizers say they spoke with the chairman of Augusta National earlier this week, and they plan on reaching out to the leaders of other majors to convey their message against these players.